All right, Cam, talk to the people, man. Let them know what's getting ready to go down. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Cam, and I'm about to show y'all eight different exercises you can do to build core and core strength. So the first exercise is going to be the pull-up leg raise. So as a demonstration, pull up, and then leg raise. Pull up, leg raise. Pull up, leg raise. Pull up, leg raise. Pull up. exercise number one exercise number two is going to be the else's now as you go on the bar you're going to instantly feel your core activate so else position keep your core tight and focus on breathing Third exercise is going to be the windshields. Get up on the ball. This exercise is for the love handles. So, Third exercise, the fourth exercise is the pull up crunches. So, you're gonna be in a supinated grip, then you're gonna four exercises you can do on the bar for your core so now we're going to take it to the floor now the first exercise on the floor is going to be the mountain climbers as a demonstration you get into a push-up position then basically push lay your knees out like so one two four y'all do that if y'all want to get the lower area of your core the bond the strength now for the sixth exercise is going to be the front planks body level meaning straight core tight focus on breathing it's all mental You can hold this for 30 seconds to a minute for beginners. If you're advanced, two minutes, two to three minutes. You pull tight.
That's for the front planks. And if you want to build that external and internal obliques, I suggest that you work with the front planks. Now, on to the seventh exercise. It is the oblique raises, or in other terms, the side planks. So what you want to do for this exercise, you're on your side, hands on your hips, you can either be on your hips, your, your legs, your glutes, whichever works best with you. Start down and raise up, keep your core tight. Whatever you do with one side, do with the other. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 3. With the side planks too, you can do an ISO hold right after you finish repping out. So for the last eighth exercise, it's going to be the, the cyclist twist. So for, for beginners, you get into this position, feet planted on the floor, and you just twist. If you have like a weight ball, that would be more effective. exercises and movements work your abdomen your internal and external obliques all of that your, your love handles which I just said your internal and external obliques it works all of that so those were eight different exercises that you could put in to your daily routines and build your core and core strength all right good so, looking out cam Links to Cam's YouTube page and Instagram will be in the description box, man. Subscribe to his YouTube, follow him on the gram. Thanks a lot, my brother. Peace, y'all. All right.